the Trump administration is already dealing with the border crisis, the Russian investigation and potential N-word tapes. Actually, on a side note, you know, I've lived in the US for many years and I still don't know what the N-word is and nobody tells me. <laughs> anyway, it's about time for another insane Trump-related controversy. And luckily, Trump supporters have responded on cue. <laughs> you'll, you'll see why that's funny in a second. Donald Trump put his name on the political map with a conspiracy theory. Why doesn't he show his birth certificate? And it's not the only time he's gone to that well. They say they found a pillow on his face, which is a pretty unusual place to find a pillow. The beautiful child went to have the vaccine, now is autistic. Recently, many of Trump's supporters are buying into something even bigger. Those Trump supporters you see waving around the letter Q are followers of Q. What QAnon is, is a fringe movement in which many baseless conspiracy theories are discussed on the internet. So I dove deep into the rabbit hole to talk to four prominent QAnon researchers, including one who has 140,000 YouTube subscribers and millions of views. What is QAnon? QAnon is basically a shadow civil war between rogue intelligence agencies and good guys, for lack of a better term. Do we all agree on this? This exists? QAnon 100%. 100%. Yeah. Oh yeah. 100%. Q's a guy it's on the internet. Not a guy. Not a guy. It's a group. The people that have the full scope of the picture is less than 10. We shouldn't be caught up on who is Q, it's more of what is it. He says that because um, what's about to be revealed is that QAnon is actually JFK Jr. So JFK Jr. is alive. And he brought the plan to Donald uh, pre-1999. Is Q more powerful than Trump? Uh, Trump is a part of the Q team. So he's, so he's just part of the team. Yeah, he's actually posted uh, at least once or twice, uh, excuse, at least twice, uh, and he's signed it. Well, we do know that because know that. he's when, he, when it's signed as 4 10 20, that's Donald J. Trump. Um, you, but you got to understand numerology to know that. There was a tweet where everything in the tweet is just regular uh, verbiage, regular grammar, but he has the word roaring, the word great, and the word reviews all in caps. You look up the numerology behind those words, and it comes out to the number 17. What does the number 17 mean? Q. That just means Q. It's the, it's the 17th letter of the al alphabet. Well, this is a lot more simple than I thought it would be. Donald Trump is one of the most intelligent men probably in our lifetime, like top five, believe it or not. I find it hard. <laughs> he might actually be right on this one, according to one reliable source. I was a really good student at the best school. I'm not like a smart guy, okay? Trust me, I'm like a smart person. In your mind, Q, Q is a force of good? Yes. And it's saving us from what? An elite satanic pedophile? Ring? One of the aspects of corruption they are working to dismantle is human trafficking rings. Yes. What big profile people are in this pedophile ring? Hillary Clinton. You think Hillary Clinton's a, a pedophile? Worse. What's worse than a pedophile? Uh, human sacrifice, child sacrifice, um, newborn babies. There's something in their blood that apparently gives them some euphoric experience. It's called that... adrenochrome. It acts as a <laughs> drug, essentially. Where do they get the babies from? Haiti. <laughs> a lot of these babies are bred specifically for that purpose. Give me five names of big names that are going down. Hillary Clinton, John Podesta, John McCain, George Bush, and... Obama. Obama. James Obama. Comey. The conspiracy theories surrounding Obama. Um, Michelle is a man. I'm just saying, there's a bulge. She's got, she, you believe that Michelle Obama has a penis. Do you, do you believe Michelle Obama is a man? I tend to think she is. What real evidence is there to support any of these claims? <laughs> what claims? What claims? You just said Hillary Clinton eats babies and Michelle Obama pisses standing up. There is no bulge. I want to make sure like people need to know this. Like QAnon is not like we are not tied to like Alex Jones or anything like re in regards to like Infowars. Like that would be like a misrepresentation of who we are as researchers. No, no, that guy's crazy. He's insane. Yeah. That's the tough thing about conspiracy theories is that a lot of them are put out there very purposely to distract and confuse and they're just BS. So what's being sent out to distract us? Flat Earth. Flat Earth. <laughs> see? See? You believe? See? So, see? so let me, please let me comment on that. All right. I'm going to blow your minds right now. You ready? Right. Looking forward to it. When we scrutinize all those things coming from NASA, it's all CGI, it's all edited. So you're telling me moon round, Jupiter round, sun round, round Earth spherical. flat. 